The U.S. Air Force is investing hundreds of millions of dollars into the Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD, program, which aims to produce a sixth-generation stealth fighter jet to replace the F-22 Raptor. NGAD, which is expected to cost up to $300 million per plane, will feature both manned and unmanned capabilities. The program follows the secretive X-Plane project from 2014, led by DARPA, which tested technologies now under consideration for NGAD. The Air Force plans to award a contract for NGAD in 2024, with Lockheed Martin and Boeing as the main contenders. How secret DARPA projects could affect the new NGAD fighter jet. The U.S. Air Force is spending hundreds of millions of dollars on the Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD, program, which aims to produce a sixth-generation stealth fighter jet. The NGAD program has been underway for several years, and the Pentagon hopes to test it by the end of the decade. NGAD is expected to replace the F-22 Raptor stealth fighter jet and become the future of America's air superiority fleet. The sixth-generation stealth fighter jet will have both manned and unmanned capabilities and could cost up to $300 million per aircraft. Before NGAD, however, the Pentagon was working on a secret X-plane that would eventually pave the way for a future stealth fighter jet. Secret X-plane The X-plane study lasted about a year, starting in 2014, according to Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall. Dubbed, the Dominance Initiative, and led by the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, the project evolved over the course of a year and recommended a series of unmanned systems that could accompany the NGAD fighter jet. Then, a year later in 2015, the Pentagon began work on the X-plane that preceded the NGAD program. About $1 billion was spent on the program, with the Air Force, Navy and DARPA each covering a third of the cost, Kendall said. The X-plane program produced several successful prototypes that tested technological innovations that are likely now being considered for the NGAD program. For the record, when the Air Force is working on a new project, it gives it an X designation for the early stages of testing and development. Such aircraft are used to test new technologies and sensors. Once the project is greenlit and moving forward, it gets a Y designation for its prototype. Finally, once the aircraft is ready and awarded a contract, it gets a designation based on its operational role. For example, F for fighter, B for bomber, A for strike aircraft, and so on. NGAD fighter. The Air Force hopes to award the NGAD contract in 2024. In May 2023, the Air Force released a classified solicitation to a small number of defense and aerospace companies for engineering and manufacturing of the NGAD fighter jet. Then, last summer, Northrop Grumman withdrew from the race for the sixth-generation aircraft, leaving Lockheed Martin and Boeing as the two leading contenders. A number of other companies, including General Atomics and Textron, are also working on various NGAD technologies. NGAD. As for engines, Pratt & Whitney is working on them and recently completed a critical assessment of the Next Generation Adaptive Propulsion, NGAP, a critical step toward the final design. While the Navy is not currently interested in a fighter jet that would come out of NGAD, it is interested in the FAXX carrier-based sixth-generation stealth fighter that would likely share much of its technology with the Air Force's NGAD.